We are back with JT at Lutcher Theater, and whether you want a season membership or just a, you know, one pass for one show, you can do it either way starting today. And the second half of the season is just as good as the first half of the season. Oh my gosh, if you loved the first half of the season, you'll be blown away with our second half of the season. It's amazing. All right, it's gonna start with Little Women, which I didn't realize is a musical. Yes, so it's adapted from Louisa May Alcott's book, and it's for the, for the stage, but it's also a musical. So we're gonna get to see the March sisters in a different light this go round. Okay, that's gonna be a lot of fun. That's one that um, younger girls are gonna enjoy as well. That's oh, yeah. something you can bring the this kids to. This is a to. good one, this is great for all ages. Ages. Um, we read the book. I read the book growing up, mm -hmm. so it's very nostalgic for me, but um, this is a good one for all ages, young to the kids at heart. All right, the next one is Come From Away, and this is something that maybe a lot of people haven't heard of. What's the story? So guys, if there's one show to not miss this season, it's Come From Away. This is a true story. It's based on 9-11, a plane that had to um, uh, divert and land in a small Canadian town and it's a story of friendship and hope in this small town that took all of these people in and um, that were just not able to make it home but they it's a musical but it's also fun and endearing and this is the one to come to. It really is a, a neat story if you don't remember from when everything was happening at that time but there was more people that had arrived in that small town than actually on planes than actually yeah. live there. And yeah. people open their hearts and their homes. It's such an endearing story. This was a smash hit on Broadway. Mm -hmm. So we're very excited and very proud to be able to bring this to the Lecture Theater and to our community. Okay, this is another one that's appropriate for all ages. Appropriate for all ages, Okay, yes. that's gonna be a lot of fun. And then the next one, of course, is if you're thinking of classic musical theater, you. Annie just jumps to mind. Yes, so we're bringing back our favorite orphan. Annie is coming back to the Lutcher. We're so excited to see her and all of her friends and of course Sandy. Um, but again, another nostalgic um, show and just everything you think about when you think about Broadway, just the songs and the costumes and the, of course the wonderful story. And it's one of those things where we think that we can sing along with every single song in the show. And you can. You can. And we encourage you to. Okay. It's so going to be fun. A fun one for the kids to come out to. If you've never been to musical theater before, this is a good one to start with because it is so accessible. You're familiar with the movies, maybe you've seen it before at other theaters, and this is one that everyone loves. Everyone loves this, perfect to bring the kids, the grandparents, the cousins, everyone. Okay, so that's gonna be Annie and that's coming up in April. After that, another big musical theater show that everyone loves. So we're bringing Chicago to the Lecture. We're very excited about this one as well because, you know, it's all that jazz and glitter and everything we love about Broadway and the dancing and the costumes. So we're excited. Another one where you know most of the songs uh, when you hear them and just a really beautiful theatrical show. Yeah, it's gonna be beautiful up here on the stage. Um, we've had um, lots of interest in this one, so get your tickets soon and hurry to get right. tickets to this one. If you saw the movie and you loved it, you're gonna love it on the stage even more because it's amazing how they portray some of the things that happen um, through dance and, and movement, and it's really just very impressive. Well, it's always fun to see the talent that comes to the stage, and then it's always um, very interesting to see how they bring the story mm -hmm. um, to our audience members. Um, I always love that aspect about seeing the behind the stage scenes. And it's been a long time since we've had Chicago in the area. So this is your chance to see it. And that again is coming up in May of next year. Then after that, we have some candlelight concerts and we're going to have candlelight in the theater. Yes. So this is new to the Lecher this season, um, but we're doing a candlelight concert series. We're bringing two very talented artists um, to the stage. And what we're hoping for is just to have a nice, intimate um, candlelight uh, concert moment. So a great day night bring your pals to um, but uh, just lots of fun and something we're trying to do different okay this so the first one is going to be in February and that is the fabulous Equinox can you tell us a little bit about that so this is a big band it's an orchestra um, these guys are from Louisiana they're fun so their show is titled Beatles to Bourbon Street okay. so it's just gonna be great entertainment great music um, very talented okay so big a band. big variety of music that you're gonna hear that night yes. and all performed by this big band it's gonna really gonna be wonderful and then in April you've got another 
another young man that's coming in that's super talented. He's super talented. His name is Scott Mulvihill. He plays the upright bass. He's very cool. He's very young. He's got like a coffee house vibe. Uh -huh. um, his music is so fun. Check him out online. Check him out at Letcher.org and come see him at a candlelight concert. All right. He's one of those guys that after you see him on YouTube or wherever you look, you're definitely going to want to come out and see that show. And again, you can get season memberships online. You can get individual tickets to those shows as well, but we encourage you to do it sooner rather than later because we know that they're going to go quickly. I think Chicago's already half full, right? I think so. So uh, get those tickets as soon as you can. And when we come back, we're going to talk again about the volunteer opportunities that are available here at the Letcher as well as some children's programming. So stay with us.